Hi, welcome to another episode of 3D Bites. Today I'm going to make uh, spaghetti. I'm going to use uh, my, my version is the West Indian seasoning. So here what I got, all my ingredients. I have the spaghetti here. One pack of Primo spaghetti. I got uh, two tablespoons of uh, brown sugar. One tablespoon of uh, black pepper. One tablespoon of salt. Three tablespoons of uh, green seasoning as has bandania, garlic, onions, pimento peppers, as well as uh, we have some celery. I have one pound of ground chicken and this is the spaghetti sauce that I'm using, thick and zesty. You can use any one if you want. I also have uh, six cloves of garlic and I have uh, two pimento pepper, one habanero pepper. I'm gonna start by just uh, cutting up the pimento peppers here. Now you can use onions if you want. I'm not gonna use onions today. Use that. Also have my garlic here. Six cloves of garlic. Okay, so I'm gonna season the ground chicken. I put the green seasoning in. It's already washed. You can wash it with lime or vinegar. Put the black pepper in. And the salt. I also have uh, one tablespoon of soy sauce, dark soy sauce. I have a pot uh, with the water boiling for the spaghetti. Does Wrap them like that. Spread them right around. Right after the boiling, and just goes inside. Let the fork itself. So it's dropped in there now. With the boiling water. Now I like to add a little bit of oil so it won't stick. And I don't put salt. But you can put a bit of salt if you want. Put a little bit of oil, olive oil on it. So I'm gonna start boiling here nicely. Our pot is already on fire. Some oil. I'll let that heat up. So meanwhile, spaghetti is boiling there nicely. I have the oil hot here. I'm gonna put the garlic and the pimento. the chicken inside. We're gonna fry. I'm still using my bone up sappy. Chicken is 
is going to cook properly. So this is going to cook for at least 10 minutes. Nice. So it's cooking nicely now. Just smell all the seasoning cooking here. This is just one pound. You can make as much as you like. You can also, if you're making two pounds, add two tins of the spaghetti sauce. I don't know how hot this is, but I'm gonna use half. Put them in. I can put the other half if the, you know, I taste it and see how hot it is. I'll put the other half. I'm also gonna put the sugar in as well. So you can cook. Now you can put oregano, basil, mint, anything you want, you can put that. But this is how I like it. And I got my, I said my wife and my children like it this way. So I make this for them all the time. All right, so this has been cooking for like 10 minutes. It's going on nicely. I'm gonna toss the spaghetti sauce in it. You gotta load on the heat so it wouldn't bubble up, spill out. You can also use beef, pork, anything, any kind of meat you can use. What makes this different is the bandania. Uh, that's our try that special ingredient, bandania. I'm not going to let the little bit waste in the tin, so I'm going to put it in. And now this is going to cook for like about 10 minutes and then you're good. And then you can start eating. So the sauce is done. It's been cooking for 20 minutes. Nicely. It's very tasty. There you go. Okay, let's go into the spaghetti now and see how it's doing. Try one. Hot. Two more minutes and I'll strain it. Spaghetti is finished. Straining it. And you see I use a wooden spoon, so less noise. So my beautiful wife here is going to do the tasting today. The birthday soon, so she got an early birthday dinner. Uh, and um, this is my favorite dish of all. And only my husband could make this the way I like it. So I'm gonna have a taste now. Mm. So good. 
So not any dog house anymore. <laughs> <laughs> and this is for Videsh and Kevin. This is a nice overnight. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for watching. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. <laughs>